Last month marked the hottest September on record, with temperatures being higher than ever recorded before. Scientists describe the margin of temperature increase as extraordinary, huge and whopping. The record-breaking trend puts the world on track for the hottest year ever, with a projected increase of 1.4 degrees Celsius compared to pre-industrial levels. Throughout the year, records for high temperatures have been broken, in June, July and August. Climate change is primarily one of the responsible causes for this temperature spike, with scientists warning of more severe conditions to come in the near future. El Nino, a weather pattern, and natural weather fluctuations are also to play here for the high temperatures. The Copenius Climate Change Service, C3S, confirmed that September's average global temperature for the air has been 16.38 degrees Celsius, a 0.5% increase from the previous record set in 2020. This temperature jump is the most significant observed since at least 1940 and has surprised scientists. Greenhouse gases have not only warmed the atmosphere, but also the deep ocean, and particularly the Atlantic, with changes in ocean circulation leading to resurfacing heat. It has also been noted that the temperature records set for September broke previous records by not only a small amount, but a rather large amount. And with the COP28 global climate talks coming up soon, in December, there is an urgent need for ambitious climate action, many say. Ocean surface temperatures have also been the second highest ever recorded in September, following only August of this year as well. All of this whilst record low sea ice cover has been described in Antarctica, continuing into September, raising concerns about the impact of climate change on the continent. Whilst it is said that natural fluctuations such as El Nino play a role in the temperature, climate change, driven by high greenhouse gas emissions, is considered to be the primary cause of the temperatures that we are seeing currently. Scientists acknowledge that many additional factors may be at play here, and these are not yet fully understood, but the information that we're seeing coming out at the minute is quite alarming in the eyes of many. So please let me know down in the comment section what do you think to this, and what do you think we should do going forwards into the future. Thank you for watching this one, and I hope to see you again soon.